welcome back onto my channel i hope you guys are fantabulously well today i'm with elsa hey. i met elsa on a trip on saturday yes I, we took her to where did we go on saturday quad biking yes. and waterfalls and cinema falls. yes, yes. Waterfalls. and uh today we are just chilling roaming around accra and i thought i'll take you guys along how did you find the trip really nice i recommend location ghana <laughs> you can book a trip with them <laughs> and uh, how are you finding ghana so far Great, I've had only nice experiences. I've met wonderful people. Ah, yes, yes. <laughs> and this is your first African country, yes, right? Yes, it is. And where are you originally from? Guadeloupe. Oh, wait, I have. I love Guadeloupe. Can you see? <laughs> yes, Guadeloupe, Guadeloupe. Caribbean. I will be going there very soon. But yes, yes. so today to. we are at Le Legon Botanical Gardens. I've been here six years, never been here before. So we're going to do a few things, and I thought I'll take you guys along. So let's get into it. <laughs> So guys, just to give you a little bit of background, Legon Botanical Gardens was founded in 1950 and is located and owned by the University of Ghana and managed by both the Department of Botany and the Mulch Company Limited. The garden consists of a playground, canopy walk and a few lakes amongst other things. Hey guys, so we've been walking around for a while. Um, they do have the canopy walk, they have the obstacle course which I yes. showed you and um, I guess, I think this is the lake or the pond or whatever where you would do the boat um ride can the canoe yeah canoe and, uh, they used to have this step boat like this paddle boat where you can mm. just paddle and go along and that would have been really fun but, but it's, it's not it's, it's not, not operational, operational so. so we're just walking around yeah. talking chatting um yeah elsa's had a really interesting life right thank you <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> How many? It's like seven. You've lived in like seven countries, no? No, not seven. So I'm from Guadeloupe. Mm -hmm. I've lived in France. Mm -hmm. I've lived in Mexico. Mm -hmm. I've lived in Belgium. I've lived in Portugal. And now I'm living in the UK. Well, how many was that? That's six. Six. Oh, I was close. <laughs> six. I was close. Six countries. And I find it incredible. So, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> and she speaks how many languages? I'd say five. So in Guadeloupe, we speak French and Creole. Mm -hmm. uh, so I speak both of these yeah. languages. And then I'll speak English, Spanish, mm -hmm. and Portuguese. That's five. Okay. So that's five. Five. Okay. That's five. five countries, five <laughs> languages. Isn't she amazing? Thank you. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna take some pictures, walk around, and then head to our next spot. See ya. <laughs> So guys, I've just met some beautiful people from London that are here for the first time. Say hi guys. Hello. The Hamilton family. Yeah. How are you finding Ghana? We're beautiful. loving it. Loving Amazing. it. Beautiful. Amazing. Amazing. And we're you're definitely blessed. coming back? Yes. yes. Definitely. I'm good, definitely good. coming back. What's your favourite part about Ghana? The people. Yeah, the people are lovely. Yeah, yeah, the the really culture, lovely. the people, the yeah. history and heritage. One love. Yeah. Yeah. Love it. Thank <laughs> you so much. We look forward to seeing you. And you guys are going to join a location Ghana tour? Yeah. Yeah. Subscribe. Subscribe. So, yes! Subscribe! Yes, please subscribe! Precious! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Thank you guys. So guys, our next stop was the Nabuki Foundation. Founded in 2006, it is a Ghanaian contemporary art and cultural institution based in East Legon. They also have a branch in Wa, which is in the Upper West Region. The foundation serves as a hub for preserving, recording and promoting contemporary arts and culture. The foundation has a wide range of programs supporting Ghanaian arts, culture and heritage and strives to support practicing Ghanaian artists. Our next stop is Living Room. If you're going to try local food for the first time, I highly recommend living room. <laughs> so guys, we got Elsa some fufu here and we're going to try different soups. So Elsa's vegetarian, so the only thing she will eat is the egg. I forced her to have eggs so she can have energy, protein. <laughs> so we've got light soup here. We've got granite soup here. We've got palm nut soup here. I'm so excited. And, and I'm juice. basic and mango juice. And I'm, well, not basic, but I got tilapia and ebba i asked for ebba and they made me ebbas which i'm very happy about okay so we've washed our hands do you want to give them a rinse or are you good okay okay yeah all right so you pinch your fufu and this is, give my, this is the first so. this is your first time okay no problem uh-huh then you can make a little dip in the middle with your thumb i want to try it so should i what should i try first oh the granite because that's my favorite okay don't be shy, get in there. <laughs> so good. <laughs> okay, another one, another one, another one. So palm nut type. Uh yes, palm nut. Okay. You like that one too? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
this is the light suit. So, out of all three, which one is your favorite? It's a hot, I need a second zip to know. It's okay. a hot one. <laughs> so what we're gonna do, we're gonna finish our food yeah, and then come it. back and ask. Okay, so let's get into this. This is so filling. I, I had no idea. <laughs> I literally, yeah, I feel bad that I'm leaving all of this, but it was really good. I just don't have space anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it's filling. Fufu is very filling. Yes, but you did well. Okay, nice. so we've got the um, the three suits here. Which one was your favorite? Okay, so show us the top three. Yeah. Okay, so three would be Hongda. So three. Yeah. And the winner is because if I say two, you will know who's the first one. I already know. <laughs> so the winner is the ground that won. Yay! Lights up really good as well. So the ground at one is. I believe they gave you fish like like it was made in fish, so you can have you taste that fishy yeah, taste, this right? Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Ground nut was. Yeah. Let me take a sip now. <laughs> Somebody that's full is still enjoying the soup. <laughs> that's good. I'm glad you enjoyed. Yes, I really did. Thank you. For that. You're welcome. <laughs> Do you have face for dessert? What's on the menu? <laughs> oh, frozen That's yogurt. Um, are you are you in? Are you feeling? I feel like I'm in dessert. There's always space for dessert. I need I need to do a meeting with my stomach. <laughs> Our next stop was Pinkberry. Now guys, Pinkberry is one of those places where it's a hit or miss. But today, I have to admit, they didn't disgrace me. So I took Elsa to Pinkberry and she absolutely loved it. We then had a dance class at Lizzie Sports Complex with DWP. Elsa was super excited. She dragged me along and I'm so happy she did. So let's get into it. Are you ready for your dance class? I'm stressed, I am. <laughs> I still look like someone that just woke up. I promise you I'm awake guys, I'm awake. <laughs> so yes, I feel like I haven't danced in so long. I'm actually very excited. I'm kind of nervous, but I am. I am, of course, because it's been a very long time. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. really miss dancing i miss being active and that reality hit me hard like it was nice right, i felt very back. probably i felt very weird like out of body because it, it doesn't feel like me anymore but then when you get it when the music plays you know like, everything goes yeah they're gonna see they're gonna remember oh. so you have to go back now yeah well you know let's that. see about that guys <laughs> but yeah thank you guys so much for watching this brings us to the end of our day things to do in our craft so yeah, Elsa, you enjoying Ghana so far? I uh, absolutely do. I'm sad I have to leave in two days. I'm, I'm really sorry. I'm really, really sorry. But yes. I'll come back. I'll be back. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. yes. And I'll be going to Guadalupe. I'll be yes, seeing her in London and Guadalupe. Yes. <laughs> Alright, then see you guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And when you come to Ghana, there's things for you to do. That's how we do. So yeah. Bye guys.
once again guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe let me know in the comments below where you would like to visit when you come to ghana and stick around and watch another video it's linked right here for you